Hello viewers and welcome to Africa and Beyond Television Network and we are taking a look on a report um, of events which are happening in the nation of Zimbabwe. President Emerson Dambuzo Munangagwa failed to land in Victoria Falls where he was supposed to open, uh, sorry, to, to attend a closing ceremony of renewable energy conference. So according to ZimLife they say Aircraft failing to land at Victoria Falls. Kenyan Airways flight from Nairobi forced to hold for several minutes before diverting to Livingstone. President Mnangagwa's Falcon 7X returning to RGM is due to attend closing ceremony of Renewable Energy Conference. This is what happened, I think, an hour ago or an hour and a half ago. And uh, these are the pictures of... Um, uh, Kenyan some time and this is President Emerson Nangagwa's uh, flight Falcon uh, X returning to Harare and uh, this is what is happening in the nation of Zimbabwe the reasons for for failure to land are uh, cited right here. Okay, I'm trying to get back to, to this report. Uh, yeah, the entity is up and up. Let me see how I can, I, I'll be able to bring it back. But uh, Zim Life then reported that uh, uh, the reason why they failed to land is because of a bomb scare. Uh, it's believed that um, there was a bomb scare which occurred or which happened at Victoria Falls uh, in the National Airport. So I'm trying to bring it right here onto the screen. Let me use another method to bring it back so that we deal with this matter once and for all. So it said Tim Zimbabwe could endorse the quit Kamnika Zimbabwe. So Nick Mangwana had um, announced that President Mnangagwa will attend the closing ceremony of Southern Africa International Renewable Energy Conference and Expo's fifth edition at Elephant Hills, Victoria Falls. And uh, it seems as if he failed to be there. in time because of the incident which occurred on trying so the major question is who uh might have put this bomb uh victoria falls international airport who might have done this per victoria falls international airport so uh, it's, it's difficult to understand what is really, really happening. So let me try to bring that report um, Yeah, in Zimbabwe we always have um, problem, network problems and Right, this is the report which is right here, which says um, okay, which says Victoria Falls International Airport shut down following a bomb scare. Zimlife sources say the airport received a call claiming there was a bomb on site just minutes before President Emerson Mnangagwa was due to land. Mnangagwa is safely landed back in Harare. So this is the report 33 minutes ago uh, from Zim Live, and um, this is what happened. So Zirugunzi Chakondresan
explanations. We hope and believe that the people of Zimbabwe are going to be safe. Uh, meanwhile, let, let us take a look onto another report. Uh, yeah, it says an air Zimbabwe plane on the tarmac at Victoria Falls International Airport, and the passengers cannot disembark as authorities investigate reports of a bomb. A scheduled Ethiopian Airlines plane is an hour um, from landing, but will likely divert to Zambia as emergency continues. So it seems as if uh, the investigations are happening at this moment in time. There are several planes which are scheduled to be leaving or to be landing at Victoria Falls International Airport, and there is a bomb scare. So we hope and believe that this is going to be resolved. And um, I don't believe that um, this is the way uh, uh, to go. Zimbabwe has been a safe country. Zimbabwe, we never had such incidents and such issues being reported in the past. We are starting to hear them right now happening. And um, it's so scary. It's so scary to Zimbabwe. Uh, we, we do not know if this, if this is true. If there is indeed a bomb, then it will mean that Zimbabwe's security is being compromised. And what will happen? Uh, it, it, it will need the government to be serious and to make sure that they deal with uh, any issue uh, surrounding uh, uh, these, these these things and so that the people of Zimbabwe would be safe. Remember, when something happens, it affects everybody and everyone. Your relatives might be there, your friends might be there, your family might be there. So you do not know if something happens in Victoria... Falls, what something because uh, ended at, uh, at at Victoria's Falls and yet to 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 go back to 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 Harare. So it means if this is not resolved, then we might go. Um, we might continue to have such issues happening, and um, we need this issue to be resolved. I do not know what you think. Let us talk in the comment section. Teams, I love you all. Thank you very much for coming each and every day. And uh, we are running a campaign right here. We are asking for partners. We are running a 2024 scholarship program where we need to assist some rural primary school kids. We also need to pay their school fees, buy books, uniforms. Uh, these are less privileged pupils at our local school. And we are looking for donations. Also on this program, we are looking forward to have... Um, uh, a, a welding machine and a generator because we need to to actually uh, uh, start manufacturing desks and benches for the schools without so we have around um 11 schools uh, without and we hope and believe that we'll be able to raise funds for the generator as well as the welding machine so that we can deal with those issues so i have placed the number right onto the screen and it's scrolling on the screen I uh, will be able to, 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 to find that number and get in touch with us if you are interested. So this is what is happening in Zimbabwe. For those who came late, we were talking about a bomb scare at Victoria Falls International Airport. And uh, President Emerson Minangagwa's plane he had to go back to Harare because of a bomb scare at Victoria Falls International Airport. Zambian, uh, Ethiopian Air, Air, Airlines is supposed to come related to. So this is what is happening at this moment. Victoria Falls International Airport is closed and um, there is no plane coming in. There is no plane going out. So this is what is happening. We will continue to take a look and update you on the situation.